one is that? Sorry, I'll, I'll be there in a moment. I've just realized I got this horrible thing like irritating my nose. Can you guys, can you guys see it for me? Hang on. It's so itchy. If, if you just like take a look up there for me, please. Thank you. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, it's another episode of Throne of Games. Ugh, yeah. It's kind of irritating. I'm sure it'll uh, go away on its own, maybe. So, what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome to another episode of Three Random Games. It is that game series where I find three random games on the internet and play them all within the confinements of this singular video. You ready for the bangers to get flowing? Yeah, me too. Go ahead and hit that like ring, and let's go ahead and do this. This first game is called Super Mario Bros, but different. I don't know why it caught my eye. It looked like a weird .exe type game. I remember playing those not too long ago, and I really enjoyed just the concept of them. Player one? One player game? Oh, shoot. Here we... Let's go to the Toad Town. Hey, okay. This is a bit different, right? Ooh, hang on. Why are these... Bro, this song... Oh, hey, I like this song, though. What's going on? I mean, I like this song, too. Don't get this wrong, Mario, but... Hey, hold up. Uh... What's going Mario, you don't want to break those, though? Hey, you know you're supposed to break those and collect the coins, right? Yep, yeah, dude just doesn't want to do it. So, this is our game, guys. It's Mario Bros, but as I said before, it's that little bit different. No idea why. Looks like the sprite has, like, more animation frames, though. Can I go down there, though? Hold on, hold on. Yeah. So far, it's like, it's, it's Mario, though. Like, we already know that. I did see there's a secret way down there, though. Uh, do I risk it before playing the rest of this level? Like, probably shouldn't. So let's just, uh, let's get this thing done. Uh, we good to jump here? Yep. It's like the same layout. It's the world one of one, man. If you know, you already know. Controls, not gonna lie, they're a bit weird, though. I mean, we're still getting the coins and what we need to do. But, like, do I need them all? I'm just gonna skip the ones I don't need, man. Mario, he's done well in this life, right? He's, uh, probably got that good net worth already. So, collecting a couple of coins on his way. Nothing to him. Like, he, he, it's no trouble, man. I think we're at the end of the level already. Oh, yep. There it is. Hey, we made it back to the castle so yeah similar experience to what we've expected what the freak is going on hey this already is super mario but a bit different uh go around the town talk to npcs okay i got you is this from a game this whole layout did they just like remake this for this uh little adventure hey how's it going hello mario okay hang on hang on bring out the inner toad welcome to the town town i'm scared a copy of you is haunting us Please help us. We need you. Is that Marge Simpson? No. <laughs> oh, I'm a toad. Look, it's one of the two. I don't know. So, weird Mario haunting the town. Uh, let me go ahead and help you out, Toad. You know, let's uh, let's see who is this weird Mario. This copy. You know any more, sir? How's it going, man? Uh, hello? Hello? What's going on? What do I... That's a pentagram? Quite, uh, quite clearly. That's a pentagram. Um... So this is Mario, but a bit different. I, I really do- I see it now, I get it. Just jump for it? Okay, this is, uh... This ain't right, man. This isn't the Mario adventure I signed up for. Hey, who's this dude? Sleeping, though? What are you, what are you sleeping for? Can we move, though? Wait, what's this? Uh, okay, we're dead. Yeah, that, that's a death right there. Oh, 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 but... He lets me live. Kinda? Hey, what's going on? I'm in a boxed off room. What is happening? Why would he do this to me? Wait, wait, wait. You gotta be kidding me, dude. We gotta beat the whole thing? Wait, hang on. What? No check- No checkpoints. Dude, you gotta be kidding me. There's no checkpoints. Bro. Bro, there's no checkpoints. Okay, so knowing that there's no checkpoints, I'm actually gonna play a bit more carefully. And I'm not focusing on the money. Like, nah, I just wanna get through this thing alive. That's the objective here, not the money. Okay, so we actually have to play more carefully. This is a genuine, like, we play as if we die. Because if we don't, we actually do die. So follow the hand this time. Go down. Oh my god. Okay, thank goodness. I thought it was gonna start me from the beginning. So there's, like, checkpoints, but then also, like, there's not. If you meet the main Mario thing. Okay, I think I get it. So push to the right. Ooh. Okay. We're actually doing this thing. Well, we're, I, I don't know if I want to do this thing, but here we are. Pentagram? Maybe? Stand in it? Uh, well, why do I want to help the ritual by standing in it? This don't feel right. I don't know what that meant. Oh my... Bro, I had no time to even understand what was happening. I'm, I'm dead again, right? Oh, oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Go, go, go. What? Oh, bro, if you hold shift, look at this. I'm sprinting. Oh my gosh, now I get it. Can you jump? You can jump while sprinting too. All right. Whoa, okay. That's more like it. And we're good! Okay, now that I know we've got a sprint button. Oh, shoot. Main buddy's castle. There it is. Hey, this game's kind of cool, though. It's quirky. It's weird, but it's an indie game, right? Oh, yo, this music is fire. What the? Bro, can I stand on these? Let's go. Hey, I'm actually into this game now. This is awesome. What the heck is happening? Like, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You can make that sound so you don't even get me. <laughs> Whoa, that's quick. Relentless with that. Okay, we see this. We got to What the freak is that? What the freak is that? I had no idea I was doing-
Oh, okay. Okay, so we have to stand on this bottom one here. That gets rid of that. Okay, we gotta, like, sprint jump. Okay, not yet. It's like we got this dude behind us. I should be really fearful about that, to be honest. I just... Guys, I shift sprinted right. Hurry up, drop, bro. Oh my, god. oh, my god. I'm still alive. Oh, my god. I'm still alive. Oh, my god. I'm dead. Okay, and I'm dead again. Bro, these controls are doo-doo, man. It's like... It's hard, guys. This this might look like I'm just doing terrible, but I'm really trying on this one here. Okay, I think I missed. Yeah, that was my bad. I'll take responsibility there. Jump the big gap. Just about made that one. Okay. Like these these controls, bro. That I'm gonna give up. I'm gonna give up soon. I'm gonna give up. Okay, genuine unfocused mode right now, guys. I'm like, look how fast that thing's coming for me though. Like, sprint, sprint. I made it. Oh, don't tell me, please. I got checked. Right. <laughs> Wait, do I laugh at that or no? That might not be funny. Nah, after all that. No, you gotta be kidding me. No, he don't deserve to go out like this. They buried him coffinless, but they gave him the headstone. You know the worms are gonna feast on that body, right? And I have no say in this? Dude, I got so far in so You're telling me I have to just accept that fate? No control over making him live? This next game is called Incoherence. I don't know much about this thing. I think we follow along two sisters with some kind of past, so maybe we're gonna learn. Fairly short game, but... Oh, well that was quick to the point. She's dead. She is dead. That must be one sister exclaiming that towards the other one. Wow, what a start. Oh my gosh, what a rough place to... Oh my... Yo, is that not uncomfortable though? Oh my god, I'm probably gonna censor that. Here we go. I need to get dressed. Yeah, um, I think you do. Looks a bit cold in this place. Now, is it? I don't know. Uh, there's a key. We'll leave that thing so we get the clothes out, right? There you go. Sound like we're sawing wood, but listen, we get maybe we get changed differently. Now we wait for the call. Call? About your sister, maybe? Nothing on the TV right now. Maybe we don't want to watch it. Kind of rough start. That's locked up. I mean, you got the key for it though, right? Let's uh Get the key, there it is. No need for the keys yet. Okay, well, she knows she's probably gonna do soon. So how is this gonna get so weird? You know, what's gonna be so creepy about it? We got pills there, prescribed drugs. I'd rather smoke. There's the phone. Yes, Mr. Corkins, I, I am on my way. Must be talking to maybe a doctor or something like that. And that's, that's it. Like we said, we're on our way. We uh, know what we gotta do. Pick these keys up. Now it's time and we, we leave this place. Can I open this back door though? That's locked up. Okay, so that's what the key isn't for. It must be for this one. I, I got it. What's this suitcase by the way? Can we comment? Not important for now. You don't know what's in there. I mean, maybe she does. She owns this place. She knows what she puts in and takes out. So Dr. Corkins is in room 60. Hey, how you doing? Uh, yeah, you just dance and swirl around out here, looking into the darkness of the corridor, not menacing at all, and I'll go to Dr. Corkin. So, what was it, number 16, though? That's 04. Okay, 14, 15. Yep, yeah, just on this side here. We got lots of water, though, you know? Is this Dr. Corkin, though? Are you good, sir? Hey, can we talk? No? Okay, 16. Lock the door, and we, uh... And then we go. Is that us? Thanks a lot for visiting me in the hotel. I understand this might not be your usual practice, but I really needed to ask. I am glad you decided to do this again. Considering your position and tragic circumstances, I was more than willing to help. Can you tell me, once again, why did you decide to move from your apartment and pay a great deal of money for this hotel? After what happened to my sister, I was unable to stay there every night. I had the same nightmare about her and it was a torture for me. I was lucky enough to get some money from my employer. A at least for now, I do not have to worry about paying the rent and I can enjoy the hotel pizza. Kate, this is not healthy. You have to face the issue right up front. You cannot live in this hotel forever. You talked about the nightmares. Can you describe them to me? They are very real at times, but usually when I wake up, the nightmare does not end. I have this deep feeling, more like a voice telling me to do something. What does that voice tell you to do exactly, Kate? It is very important to say it out loud to ensure that it is not real. The voice tells me to, to kill someone. Uh-oh. To kill? Who? Does the voice specify a person? A, a name? Is it somehow connected to your sister's suicide? Kate, I need you to focus on this. I don't know. It just tells me to kill. I see my sister and she's so real. But there is something off about her. Something sinister in her voice. Kate, does your sister tell you to kill someone? Do you see her? Do you see your sister in this room right now? <laughs> Kate? Kate? What the heck? I'm sorry, my head hurts. This medication is not helping at all and I don't know what to do. I don't know how to get her out of my head. Hey, I think we're seeing her too. Cause we started screaming like that and she's not worried. Kate, I, I need you to stay alert at all times. I will prescribe something for the headache. We will meet again in three days, all right? And if there's an emergency, please call me. All right, all right. I'll try to do the medication technique you told me. 
Thanks again for the talk. It means more to me than you can imagine. Looking forward to the next visit. What the freak just happened though? What was that? Uh, I should go to my room. Ain't gonna lie, Kate. Literally forgot where you live though. We got dude, he's uh, enjoying the painting. Can we talk? Hey, sir. How's that looking, huh? Uh, okay. Fascinated by every single part of that picture. And we, you know what? Let's just leave him to it. Number three, right? Yep, here we are, number three. Let's go back in. What is that on the table? Uh, first off, clean clothes folded. Appreciate the hotel people, man. They're doing the work for me. Let's uh, put these away. I'll check what's on the table after. Somehow, I'm tired. I should lay down. After we check that table, though. It's just the pills, right? That's... We've already seen these. Prescribed drugs or other smoke. Oh, you mean this... Oh, this table, though. Okay. Dear Mrs. Anderson, we hope this letter finds you well, and I want to extend our appreciation for choosing Velvet Vista Hotel for your recent stay. Unfortunately, it has come to our attention that there are some issues that require immediate attention. We've received multiple complaints from other guests and our staff regarding loud banging noises and an unpleasant odor originating from your room. To ensure the comfort and tranquility of all our guests, we kindly request that you please adhere to the hotel's noise policy and be mindful of your noise level. If there is a specific issue or concern that requires our attention, please do not hesitate to contact our front desk. We appreciate your understanding and cooperation in this matter, and we look forward to the remainder of your stay at the hotel. Sincerely, Velvet Vista Hotel Manager. Whatever, I should put those clothes in the basket. Okay, these ones too? I don't need to- huh? I mean, we already did that though, right? One step ahead, like, but we done that? Do we just lay down? Because we wanted to sleep afterwards anyway. Hold up. I guess we woke up. Hey. Who's there? Hang on a moment. Yeah, I got my key number three. Do I want to open this? this? This game feels weird, dude. Who's knocking? Excuse me? Hello? What the heck? I should close that. Why is this making me feel so uneasy? Um, okay, we'll close that. Oh! Hey! That's the same lady. Crap, the lights! I should get my phone! Whoa, whoa, whoa. hey, hey! The oh, freak? Hey, I think I'm, uh... Hey, dog, what are those things you gave me? They're making me see some stuff. And then see more stuff. Wait, where am I? Hospital ward is locked. We got computer. Vending machines. Hey, at least they're stacked up, though. Hey, what's this down here? We got... Uh, can't look at those. Uh, can't click on the doors. They're all locked. We got a note down here, too. Why'd I even come here? This hospital is rotten. I wish my sister was here. But as usual, she has too many problems to deal with. Like me, an addict who's trying to break free from all of this. Okay, this game's got some, like, pretty serious, uh... Serious themes behind it. So we know about our sister passing. Is that the sister speaking? Same picture we saw in our hotel room. Uh, great. Yeah, this don't feel right, guys. Nothing there this time. Uh, doors don't open up. Is it just to repeat? We got a bucket down there. We'll go through further into the hospital. Wait. Hello? I can't. Wait, what? Okay, what are we trying to do here? These doors? That's locked. Um, don't see a note anywhere. Wait, what the heck's happening, dude? I can't go anywhere. Oh, on the wheelchair. Every day is the same loop. I go to hospital, get some meds, try to be a better self. Yeah, but what's the point? My sister doesn't even care anyway. I might die tomorrow and she wouldn't even remember. Is this about us? Forgetting about our sister or something? The way maybe our sister felt? I don't know, during recovery or something? We got a lot of notes stacked up there. Okay, so this game's pretty serious though. We're seeing this. Nothing on there this time. More notes. That's sealed up again. Left a note in the bucket. Nope. Just standing here on the floor. My medical history is pretty short. Nothing of value in broken things, but maybe if my sister is interested, maybe if she can pick up the phone and at least once be curious. All I can do is hope for the best. Just like us, us trying to deal with our sister's, like, loss or something. Bro, the... Why can't I try this door? It won't open. Wait, what's... I'm looking through this. Uh... What? Okay, nothing here. Oh, we're trying to find records. Got it. This one here. Let's see what we got. We got one more bag there as well. Is it going to be a last one? Really? Dude, they really hear us like that. Three for three. I had to check every single one before I even got what I needed. It might not even be here. Is it? There it is. Demography details. Did I say that right? I don't know. This something year old patient presents for the alcohol and cannabis withdrawal. History was obtained from the patient. Single year old woman with bipolar alcohol. Dude, this is some serious topics right here. She's made with symptoms of depression, including CAH. Hearing voices telling her to do that. She's outpatient program and wants to change her life this time. Referral papers reviewed. Discharge summary. Discharge instru instruction. So what, they discharged her? Wait, what? what the heck is going on with this game, man? Now we keep seeing her. It's like... Whoa. We really keep seeing her. Hold up. Let's, uh, check in on our sis. Hey, sis, how's it going? Did we still ignore her? What the freak? On the back of her head. Hey. Uh. I don't like this. Bro. What the freak was that? The computer. Is the computer on? Hold up. Bro, look, there's something on the screen. I don't know what that is. We can go through again. Crap. The battery died. Now what? 
Now we're in the dark, man. There's a note by the computer here. It's uh, continuing the story, I guess. Do you feel it now? Do you feel guilty, you selfish bitch? You abandoned me when I needed you. You made a promise. You said you were always going to be with me. Go back. Go back and end this. What do you mean, go back and end this? Wait, hold up. What do you mean, no? Go back. Wait, what? Go back and end this? So is that the voice we're hearing, though? I should check on my sister. For Wait, so we're back here. Where is she? What the freak is going on? Bro, what? This game is like, oh my, okay, I, I can't do anything to help. Blood coming through the wall, we got the phone. Hey, I don't know, what, what can we What can we do here? Dude, this is, this is a crazy game. What do I do? I've got this. That game was insanely full on. Are you serious right now? Like, that was crazy with the themes, bro. Yeah, I'm sure I put some disclaimers about that game at the start, but uh, yeah, this was uh, one of the top rated games on Itch at the moment, and it's got a very sort of psychological, almost like Silent Hill style with it. Probably a lot of censoring at the end. I couldn't really show a whole bunch, and I'm just hoping that, like, because we went to sleep, right? And then when we woke up, it was nothing but sort of like delirious things that we're seeing. I'm hoping maybe that was the pills that the doc had given us, and what was actually happening we were seeing didn't actually go down, because that wouldn't really make sense. Where would these things come from? Yeah, I just hope that the ending was more of a symbolism of like she kind of cleared the voice from her head Not actually like doing it with the the way that we saw it because if she was in a dream It wasn't like actually taking herself out That's what I'm kind of hoping there because it could be that like someone dealing with grief trying to you know Materialize things and that's her dreams and the way she was seeing herself kind of getting rid of it It's kind of an intense theme probably one of the most intense realistic type theme games we played in a while though Let me know what you guys thought of that one, but let's go ahead and check out game number three this last game is called Red's Revenge. I think we are basically some kind of clean out. We are tasked with going into like an abandoned hospital and we have to clean it up. Maybe someone's gonna buy the place. Maybe they already did. They wanna actually kit this thing out so it becomes a hospital again. You've been hired to power wash a recently renovated hospital. The owners brought the hospital after it was abandoned for several years. The renovations are nearly complete. However, teenagers are somehow sneaking in at night and putting up graffiti. This job should cover this month's run. The hospital was far from town and you arrive at night. So we got to do this thing in the dead of night. Okay, I see how this goes down. Very dark, by the way. These lights don't do enough to make me feel comfortable in this place. Oh, my phone's going off. Thanks for taking this rush job. The last guy quit. Got spooked. Power washer is in the back office. Keys on the reception desk. All right, boss. And I guess here we go. This is the uh, reception desk. Okay, we can move our feet if we want to. I mean, I want to get the job done. It's far away from town, late at night. So uh, let's get to it, right? It should be harmless. Creepy environment, yes, but... Ultimately, we are just cleaning this place up. Got some keys, got some paperwork too. Patient 99. The patient was found unresponsive in the woods. I'm not sure, dot, 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 dot. I've run many tests and I've yet to find anything physically wrong. Dot, 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 my granddaughter. Okay, suspect, but all right. Whoa, okay, my feet are powerful. So where's my power wash at though? Well, I can just push all this. Woo, okay, wee, let's go. We I like this. Key for the back office, so uh, we go get this thing done. You've used a power washer before, right? Just point and spray. Client won't pay if you don't clean all the graffiti. All right, boss. I hear you, and here it is. My very own Ghostbuster weapon. Yep. Can I spray now? Hold up. How do I do it? Whoa! Okay, hold up, hold up. So we're looking at this on the walls, the graffiti. Gotta clean this junk off. Okay. Kind of satisfying. We see this? And we just gotta get it done. It's like Power Wash Simulator, but this is like horror version. I got a suspicion. We're gonna see some, uh... Kind of weird things go down. What's the distance on this? So we can get kind of far back. We like that, but make sure we clean every ounce of the graffiti. Like, I haven't seen any residue left on this. Get it off. There you go. 150 straight in the bank. Look at that. Hey, someone wants to come through. I see some kids. Yeah, this room looks clean. I'm just going to, uh, there you go. Windows clean. Do the extra for the clients so they see that we, uh, you know, we put the work in. So, yeah, it makes sense. Like, kids break in this place. They want a graffiti straight away right over there. Well, uh, hey, boss. Power problem in this place? Also, what the heck is going on? Yeah, that, oh, we can do that! <laughs> hey, that's satisfying though. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hey, let's go. I need I need me one of these for my office, man. Move the box around there in the way. Let's go. I like it. Love, love, love. I mean, it's, it's a nice piece of graffiti with a better message than, uh, you know, saying hey, hey, hey. So. Wait, 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 what? Hey, what the heck was that? Anyone back here? Any ghosts? Any kids? I will shoot you with the war gun. Not, not really. I won't, you know, do it for real. Come on, man. Yeah, there's a weird sense of, uh, like, not being alone in this place, even though, like, that's the whole point. I'm supposed to be here doing this job on my own. Previous guy got spooked, and I can tell he didn't even clean a single thing in this place. Like, kind of mad, actually. He didn't do anything to help me. We were here. Oh, that's some original graffiti. Great. And uh, lovely strawberry. Thanks for that, guys. Appreciate that. Gotta get it. 
What are these? Is that something in the pipes? What is it? We got rats in there? I mean, I'm not, I'm not down to deal with them. I'm supposed to deal with the graffiti on the walls. I'll do my bit, but someone's gonna come back and, uh, and they're gonna have to do their bit too, because that ain't right. Why does this place know when I clean things on time? It's like, damn it. The last guy just told me he left the headlamp down the hall. What do you mean? Down the hall? Down here? Hold up. I'm actually kind of creep, bro. I, I mean, I gotta go. I gotta clean this, right? Uh. Whoa, yeah. whoa, whoa. Hey, hey. Hey, I'm sick. <laughs> what the freak? I'm. Wait. I'm help. Trap. Help. Help. Hang on. Ooh, that's interesting. It's like someone's communicating via the graffiti like a ghost or something. Interesting idea. I mean, uh, yeah, I see that, but listen. My job ain't to rescue the, you, no. I'm, I'm stuttering over my words because I'm scared. That's bad. Like, if someone really is trapped in there, you know, using their last ditch effort to get some help, and I'm just here like... Now, nah, we'll help you out. Look, we'll, we'll keep our eyes peeled. Maybe we're going to see you in the graffiti. Maybe we'll see the graffiti of you being chased by the ghost, and I'll clean the ghost up. And then I'll leave you. You see, that? that's kind of cool. I can't even see down there, bro. Wait, clean it. Free me. Wait, wait, wait. Hang on, hang on. Clean this? Uh, I got you, I think. Is that the guy who's trapped? Help me. There you go, I see you free, so we're good, right? Uh, okay, I think I messed up. I'm just gonna clean up, guys. Listen, this is my job. I'll clean this up. If I summon some kind of voodoo poltergeist ghost thing, they can deal with it after, right? I'm here for my money. I'm making my money, that's it, okay? I don't, I don't, I'm not here to, uh, you know, deal with that stuff. The priest has got your back. I think. Is there anything through that? Oh, this feels weird. This genuinely feels weird. Too many corners. Too many corners. Boss. Do this right and I'll give you the bigger cut. Hey boss, I haven't complained though. What? Bro, what the freak is- Hey, hey, you're lucky you dropped down. This is sick work prank, right? I'm waiting for the boss to be like, surprise, you know, wait, nah. Bro, I'm wearing headgear though. Yo, this is weird. This is actually really cool as an idea. Clean this place up, clean the hospital. It reminds me of the, uh, the window cleaner game. Like, you know, it's like power simulator, but we're actually playing a horror game here. Don't focus on anything around. Even though I see a document on that table and I'm definitely gonna read it because that's just what I do. I think I just erased another one of the symbols to uh, keep the demon thing at bay. So that's not good. Patient 99, the one from before. I've dismissed all of the patients and staff. I believe I have found a way to save her, but not her body. I have to try. Wait, wait, this is a story in this place closing down, right? Wait, 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 look! Yo, what? We're good now, though. Look at that. The stuff back here is gone. Okay, so we have a doctor trying to save someone. Then we just found a sa way to save her, not her body. Whoa, hey, hey, hey! All right, she'll hurt you. I'm starting to believe the weird scribblings on the wall. But still, I think about money. I don't think about me actually, you know, living. I'm more interested in the money to try and live, even though I'll never get to experience that at this rate. Priorities aren't straight, man. Priorities are not straight. This is not good. So we came from the left, right? Okay. Wait, do we go back? What the frick? What's going on? Hey, anything else here though? Hello? What do I do? I'm gonna run back. There was a couple of rooms in the dark, right? Like these ones here. Oh, shoot. Granny's... Whoa. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. But she doesn't have to watch. So, tell us to look away or something. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna regret this, man. Let's get it off, okay? I'm gonna... Look, look. Ah. Uh, hold up. Ah. Uh, no, I messed that one. I was gonna try and make it spell Ryan, but didn't do it. Just got cash. Just got cash. Back there, wait. I don't wanna go back there though. Hold up, but I do, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. What's with the flip? is this where it went down? Hold up, hold up. Yo, those chairs are doing something weird, hold up. That's, that's inappropriate though. Okay, run it back, couple more rooms. This one here? I can't open this. Hello, I can't open, wait, E, I can. I was stupid, I forgot to use a handle for a moment. Is that it, this here? Wait, there's nothing in this room. No dirt, no stains, no grime. Last guy did a good enough job. Do I leave, do I go back? Like, what else do I do here, this room? This room? Nope, this ain't it. Oh, we got stuff back here as well. She's here? I don't know if I want to clean that, guys. If she's here, then uh, I think I want to go home. Let's just do our thing, right? Let's just uh, let's do our thing. This is a graffiti thing that we should really be paying attention to, though. Whoever's writing these, they're doing it with the intent on actually helping me out one way or another. And I'm just disregarding it by, um, I guess, cleaning it. I mean, I'm taking it on board. I am, but... Also, I'm still just cleaning, and I'm not trying to save my own life, so I, am, I, or am I really taking it on board? The client let me know if some of the main doors are locked, they'll need a breaker reset to open. What does that mean, dude? What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Hold up. This door? That's not gonna open. Okay. This weird purple color coming through. It's strange, dude. It's strange. I'm glad I'm geared up with the weapon. It isn't the weapon of choice, but it is a weapon. You know, turn the force up nice and high, blast them back. Run in the darkness, right? Run in the- Whoa! Hey, hey! Just impulse doing that by this point. Someone comes to my fix. They know not to attack me from the front now because like... 
That's my emotional response. In here, in here. Stop, she'll get out. They're telling me, dude, they're luring me around. They're trying to make me realize, but here I am, stupid as heck, still doing this. Wait, free me. There's two different forces, like two spirits trapped here. It's a cool idea. I like it, man. It's like the spirits that passed away in here maybe communicating through the, uh, the graffiti on the wall. Talking about kids doing this. I don't know, sir. Oh my gosh. Uh, well, I mean, someone spilled the red paint, right? Definitely just red paint. <laughs> oh gosh, yeah, this is not red paint. This is, uh, this is the blood of a victim. Yep, cool, got it. Gotta go back here, right? Reset the, just reset the breaker. Just reset the breaker and we're good, all right? And if she comes near me, I'll break her. You see what I did there? <laughs> Enough of the jokes. We ain't, we ain't down for that, okay? There it is, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. So we got doors open, right? Doors, and now open. Let's make our way back. Let's make what the okay? She's probably sat there comfortably, you know, watching me. Whoa! Oh my! Yeah, I can do that too. Look, but blast these off. Look, yeah, you're not the only one with that power. Okay, I need to leave this place, bro. This is weird. This whole idea is strange. So we've reset the breaker. It's why is it so dark? My my head torch is getting weaker. Or this place is just allowing less and less light through. Almost. Almost what? Oast. Oh, getting fifty dollars per clean now. We're getting ripped off. Are you serious? Run it back. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, this ain't it, dude. This is messed up. It's messed up, but it's that cool kind of messed up. It's like the messed up where I'm like, yes, yes, I want to see what happens. Definitely get rid of this mess. What are you doing? Walking around with you? Your intestines hanging out, man? You got your entrails on you, man? Dude, we're getting 25. We're getting less and less now. Gran will get you. Uh, Gran, uh, hang on a second. I'm gonna change this message. Will you? That's it, that's just all they say. They're just very authoritative. You cannot escape. I'm gonna change that, look, look. We actually have a very supportive ghost. Look, you escape. I can, I can do it. Okay, get it off, just get it off. Oh boy, oh boy, I don't wanna make money anymore, guys. No, I'm down to not make any more money. Yep. This is why I'm not down to make more money. Whoa, whoa. Okay, I'm sectioned off, bro. I'm stuck here now. This is it. The walk of... Whoa, wait, yeah, stay in there. Glad you can't open that door. You're gonna be glad that that spirit locked those. We can actually see them. Oh, no. oh! That's, that's just a response, guys. That's all I do. It hurts, does that say? Uh, what? Okay, this is genuinely kind of creepy now. Uh, let's make this very... Can do that. Hang on a second. Let me just move you. Move you. Hang on, hang on. We're gonna make this a very British uh, saying right there. It hurts. I'm sorry it hurts. I'm just gonna clean this up. Oh, we're done. We're done. Where's the doll? What? Ah, oh, little disappear, reappear magic trick. Yeah, great. Yeah, so, so cool. So amazing. Let me go. <laughs> a rich death. Hold on. A job well done. However, you never made it back home and your boss got all the money. Is this all there is? Make money until we die? In this world with the spirits? Yeah. I think it kind of is, though. Alright, guys, that was another episode of 3 Random Games. A little bit of a mixed bag with the games we play, but sometimes that's kind of refreshing. If you guys do want to check out any of the games I did in this video, they're all linked down below. But that's going to be it for this video, and I really hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, why not drop that like rating? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thanks so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, if you did enjoy. Yeah, and Mom always said I never cleaned enough. Well, I'm going to show her this game. See, I was the right one all along.